Hi guys, this is Barbara with Quartz Rose Tarot. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so that you're notified when we release new content. So Leo, Leo, you have been patient for a long time. You have an emperor trying to come back to you, but there is somebody playing nonsense, doing magic, and they really are fighting to come back towards you. But that person who's doing the, the trickery is really still trying to cause havoc. So stick around. Let's see where this goes. Leo, let's get into your energy, then we'll get into the energy of all 12 signs, then we'll get you some oracle cards, actually. Let's get into your spread, and then we'll get you some oracle cards. So with that, Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Leo. Leo, I feel like you're ending something and walking away. So let's get into this and find out why. Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Leo. Give you the energy of all 12 signs around leo starting with aries you're dealing with an aries someone's paying i feel like this is i feel like this is an illusion uh, somebody's playing mind games and trying to win at all cost with an illusion here if you're dealing with an aries if you're dealing with a taurus i feel like someone's very anxious because you're not speaking if you're dealing with a Gemini, um, someone's blocking communication. If you're dealing with a Cancer, Cancer's moving forward with communication. If you're dealing with a Leo, Leo, you're manifesting. What are you manifesting? You're manifesting your Two of Cups. Good job. If you're dealing with a Virgo, Virgo is very guarded and defensive about an apology or an offer. If you're dealing with a Libra, there's burdens with somebody from the past. If you're dealing with a Scorpio, Scorpio is trying to understand something from a different perspective with a new beginning in love. If you're dealing with a Sagittarius, um, very negative energy there for Sagittarius. Their wish fulfillment is a heartbreak. They want you to be heartbroken over them. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, um, someone's being strategic about speaking the truth. If you're dealing with an Aquarius, um, divine timing is a new passionate beginning. And if you're dealing with a Pisces, somebody's rushing towards a new beginning or rushing in to move forward or trying to rush in to move forward or rushing moving forward. One of those. Under the bottom of the deck, it's about clarity, getting some clarity. Okay, so Leo, you're ending something and walking away. Let's see why. Holy Spirit, angel spirits and guides, clarity and guidance for Leo. What does Leo need to know, please? Okay, so somebody's not speaking, they're using their intuition, but there will be justice with this emperor, okay, in a relationship. Taurus and um, Aries energy for that emperor. Taurus energy with the Hierophant. So you may be dealing with a Taurus or a Libra or possibly even a Cancer uh, Pisces as well. Uh, something for a long time needs to balance Sagittarius energy. Needs to be patient for, been patient for a long time is what I'm feeling. Okay, so you're at a crossroads, two twos, um, trying to find out what decision you want, which direction you want to go. I feel like there's a third party here. So you got two twos and a three here. So we're uh, the third party, juggling a third party, queen of wands. This could be your energy or this could be um, the energy of somebody who's who's interfering. So let's figure out what this is. Somebody's at a crossroads, looking out towards the future, trying to figure out their path. It has to do with juggling a third party. Queen of Wands, there's a lot of strife, jealousy, and competition. There is an apology or an offer here. But I feel like you're getting justice. 
with this emperor relationship that you haven't spoken to. You haven't spoken to this person in a while. So moving forward or moving on, queen of swords, someone is being strategic, not showing emotion because of betrayal. So I feel like king of cups, cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I feel like there was an illusion here around this person, um, to be honest with you. Um, this was Aries energy, but I, my chair is not acting right. Okay, so what I feel like is the person, okay, Aries energy, Leo energy. Um, but I feel like with Leo, you may have been the third party in a situation. Even though you are the queen of wands in this, for some reason, I feel like you were the third party. So the queen of swords is moving on because of betrayal. You haven't spoken to this person for, for, for a long time, but there's justice for the emperor in this relationship because he's been patient for a very long time. And I feel like you haven't spoken to this person for just as long, okay? But you're at a crossroads about this, about this person juggling you. Because maybe you didn't know that they were in a relationship, but you were the third party here, Leo. You were. You were the third party. And there was a lot of competition. You're, there's, you, I feel like you're, there's a lot of strife, jealousy. There's drama. There's drama here around this apology. Whatever this person's going to say to you, this other person is moving on because of their betrayal. So this person's now single. Emperor's now single because this queen of swords is moving on. He's coming in. He could be, you could be dealing with either a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio energy. Your emperor could be a Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio, just saying. But I feel like there was an illusion. So somebody could win at all costs playing mind games. And I feel like it was that queen of swords here. So let's get into this and find out what's going on for Leo. You haven't spoken to this emperor in a long time because of deception. They weren't speaking to you because of deception, what they did, but there's justice here. But they have to make a decision on which way they need to go to get it. Emperor energy wants to reconcile. Or his. this could be this person's wish um, as a relationship. No, I feel like he wants to reconcile a relationship that was blocked. This person, this person, this queen of swords, this queen of swords blocked this person from you. There was an illusion of mind games trying to win at all costs. It wasn't coming from this king of cups. This was done. I feel like this was done to this person. There was deception, and that's why they weren't speaking to you. Um, they're at a crossroads on how to get justice. They want to reconcile the relationship, but the relationship was blocked. It was blocked. I feel like it was blocked by this person. So for a long time, this person was patient and they wanted to work on a situation and they wanted to communicate with you. They wanted to communicate. Now they're at a crossroads. Now I feel like this is your energy kicking in, Leo. You're at a crossroads. For a long time. Again, again, for a long time. This has been going on for a while. You're at a crossroads trying to figure this out for a long time. And the juggling made you angry. I feel like you're very discontent about whatever this juggling was. Um, you were the third party. So I feel like the third party here. Queen of Pentacles. So I feel like Queen of Pentacles to me is the Empress in a minor arcana. OK, because you have an emperor here. So this third party was the queen of pentacles, two of cups. OK, this is the person. This is the empress energy here. You're coming in as the queen of wands here. This is you. It's causing you a tower. It's a tower moment because this you're a true match with this person. And you know you're a true match with this person. You love this person with all your heart, but you're not happy with them. You know, it's one thing to. I know one thing I said to my twin one time is I will always love you, but I just don't like you right now. And there, you know, that's just how you, you, you feel about this situation. You may love them with all your heart, but there's times when you just would rather, you know, not even look at them. You're so mad. 
Strive jealousy and competition. It's because divine timing's at play here. And this apology, they're going to apologize to you for leaving you out in the cold, Leo. This is it. This is this is coming to you in divine timing. All of this drama came to you in divine timing because they want to apologize for leaving you out in the cold. And this moving forward, Queen of Swords, because of the betrayal, not speaking, because of juggling, because they were juggling you, because they're juggling you, okay? Needing strength for a family situation. King of Cups, I feel like this is an illusion and somebody was manipulating and playing mind games trying to win. Yeah, magic. Mm, imagine that. They wa they're watching. They're watching. They're watching that they want to cause they want to cause strife, jealousy, and competition to this third party. They they want see they they want to work on they're trying to watching and wanting to work on the the drama, wanting to work on the drama of somebody feeling stuck and bound. They're continuing because why you're the empress and you know what's going on. You're awakened. You're awakened. And you're still holding on to this person. He's coming in as your king of pentacles, somebody who's very solid, stable, dependable, to have this new passionate beginning. You know, I could go into this whole deck right now because I have this queen of swords again under the deck. At, in the 11 11, she's trying to make a decision to cut out something with an illusion because there's a choice between two for this emperor, okay? But he wants to offer his love and he's very anxious about getting justice to heal a situation, to move it forward. I mean, you can't make that shit up. You just can't. So, wow, Leo. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, so let's see what's going on for Leo. So I feel like receiving, you're receiving downloads to heal a situation. Uh, inner child, this is about you working on your inner child to heal. Um, you're receiving receiving those downloads that you need. Somebody's feeling bound, and I feel like like this is your person. And divine timing's at play, though. So things are going to happen the way they're meant to happen. You know, this separation, um, Settling in the spring. I feel like settling in the spring. So you may have a couple more months before this person comes back around. They are thinking about you. They are contemplating. They have regrets. You know, sometimes they just get caught up in this thing of the one thing is, is that some of these, some of these guys, uh, the emperors, I will say emperors, um, it doesn't matter. It could be either way they they want to appear strong but the problem is is they're they they fear they have fear where this person who's doing magic on them or um interfering in a relationship they're afraid of what this person can do and and i think that that almost controls them in a way because they don't want to uh, they don't know how to fight back against whatever's happening okay but they're saying laugh at your demons laugh at them okay Turn, tune out distractions. Don't let that nonsense bother you one bit. Okay, embrace your power. And I feel like that emperor needs to embrace his power as well as the empress. Both of you embrace your power, tune out distractions and laugh at your demons because you're way stronger than that. You just have to acknowledge that within yourself. Honestly, honestly, that truer words couldn't be spoken. You are stronger than that as an emperor, but some of them, they, they stay in that nonsense because they're afraid to, uh, to fight back. They're afraid to fight back. Confidence and beauty, career, uh, new beginnings. Um, Leo, you have it all. Honey, you have it all. If you're a feminine energy, it could masculine energy, it doesn't matter. Okay. You got beauty, confidence, and career. You got your shit together. Okay. There is this new beginning coming for you. I feel like you got what you need. It's coming. And I, I feel, but I still feel like uh, the uh, person that they were dealing with is still going to try. So it's it's time for you both to stand in your power and take control. So Leo, I'm going to take this over to the extended and get you some more clarity. So with this, uh, if this resonates, please leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you over in Vimeo for the extended.